Well, this is fantastic yeah. that we have the whole, the whole, I know, we've got the whole cast of heroes and we're going to be, but Zach, I want to talk to you because how important was it for you to kind of set aside the Chuck image and do a show like this? Uh, it was really important. I mean, I thought, you know, Chuck was an incredible journey that I got to go on and um, I built so much of my current fan base and career off of it. A lot of people, most people had no idea who I was before that. And most people who do know me, know me, know me from Chuck. Um, and it was also an incredible kind of partnering with the original heroes. It's where I know Jimmy John Louis and Greg Grumberg and Sendel and Zach and Hayden and all those guys from. And you know, we premiered this, their second season was our first, and so uh, it was. It seemed very, um, I don't know, kismet of yeah. sorts to to see this come around and that it be a 13 episode miniseries and. Uh, and just want to kind of jump back into that, jump into back back into business with NBC, who's mm -hmm. been just you know really good to you. a great alumni, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or I'm a great alum, or they're they're, they're they're my yeah. I'm <laughs> alumnus. They're my alma mater. There we go. There you go. Um, <clears throat> and um, and you know, with, sitting down with Tim Kring, you know, I had a, 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 quite a few conversations with him leading into the you know doing the show because I wanted to make sure that I was going to play a role that really challenged myself and also challenge people's perceptions of, of who I was and what I did, you know, because yeah. Chuck was a very specific kind of character. Probably more, I'd, I mean, I, people ask me what character is most like you. I mean, Chuck was yeah. so much like me because he was such an amazing person with such great <laughs> qualities. He was intelligent and <laughs> funny and, and smart. Special. Um, yes. And uh, so I, but no, he, you know, yeah. was, there was a, there was a lightheartedness and um, a, a lightness and a levity yeah. to him. And uh, I wanted to just, you know, get darker and dirtier. Well, and dirtier. that's what I want to ask you. Yeah. I, mean, I, I know you can't tell me, you know, the big premiere. I know you guys are going mm -hmm. tonight. We're going to see it on mm -hmm. here next week. Yeah. But real badass in this. Tell me about how much fun it is to play. I mean, yeah, it's, it's uh, I, you know, it's interesting. Is that, you know, on one hand, it's a lot of fun. And on the other hand, um, it's really heavy. So when you sit in heaviness all the time, it takes a toll on you personally um, you know those actors and I'm typically not somebody who has a hard time leaving work at work um, but you know there's there's been some really intense you know heavy stuff with this with this character in particular that um, even when you get to go and be badass and go you know kick people's butts or kill them or whatever it is that I do that I can't tell you right now um, it, it's not it's not all just fun the stuff I got to do on Chuck was always pretty fun because it was always me beating up specifically bad guys as opposed to me being a really twisted and tortured person who may or may not be executing really lovely people because I don't, because I misunderstand them. You were a fan of the original Heroes, huh? I was, yeah. I only got to watch really the kind of the beginnings of the show because Chuck was a full time, you know, I was there all day every day. I didn't I didn't have time to see friends let alone watch television. Yeah. Um, although some somehow in there, I think I was able to figure out how to get lost still on my on my dance card. <laughs> and let me tell you, that was an investment well spent. Yeah. What the hell, JJ? <laughs> how did the uh, the originals embrace all you newbies? Oh, incredibly well. Oh, I mean, again, I've known them for yeah. years through NBC, so there was already kind of a really fun camaraderie there. Um, and then, of course, everyone who's new in the cast, you know, has just been thoroughly embraced. In fact, in some ways, we're embracing them because they're, uh, other than Jack, who is really the glue that brings the yeah. two worlds together, Greg, Mossy, Jimmy, um, uh, who else, Sendel, yeah. um, uh, th they're in, you know, what, Three episodes, four. Actually, I can't really talk about that stuff. That might yeah, be that might be spoiling. Okay. That's okay. We're gonna find might be spoiling story. some of that stuff. Anyway, out. the point yeah. is, we're the cast. <laughs> we're embracing them, and we're doing an excellent job of it. Okay, so first series, it was save the cheerleader, save the world. What's the tagline for this one? Um, I think it's um, fifteen percent. It's no, it's fifteen minutes can save you fifteen percent or more on your car insurance. I think, which is longer, <laughs> and really has nothing to do with. Saving the world, but it is true, yeah. and Geico should pay me for that. And they should. Uh, if you've got lots on the on your plate, and I just I talked to the other guys, but you guys, I just congratulations to you. I'm so thank so you. happy for thank you. you, and thank you for giving. You're the bomb. Us. You're the bomb.com. I, I love honestly, you to pieces.